Remember that Staples commercial with the easy button where you press it and everything's just suddenly easy? Well, I hate to break it to you, but in personal finance, there's no easy button. Hi there, my name is Mindy Jensen, and I'm the host of the Bigger Pockets Money Podcast. You've probably heard me give the same money advice over and over again for the last five years. In fact, you've probably heard the same money advice from everybody in the personal finance community. Track your spending, make a budget and stick to it. Have an emergency fund, invest for your retirement. I know that I'm repetitive. I tell you over and over again, spend less, earn more, invest wisely. I talk about being frugal and maxing out your retirement accounts. Why? Because that's the proven way to build wealth and get to financial independence. I see people asking questions every day. How can I accomplish this amazing goal without following these steps? You can't. There is no easy button in personal finance. You can't become financially independent by spending every dollar you make. And you won't get there through your W-2 alone. You're here watching this video. You clearly want to change your financial life. Are you wondering why you don't have any money left at the end of the month? Track your spending every single dollar to see where your money is actually going. When you start tracking your spending, the results will be eye-opening and you'll start to see patterns and ways to reduce your spending almost immediately. You are probably a victim of only a dollar syndrome where you're spending small amounts of money because they are inconsequential. Well, one time might be inconsequential, but they add up and they quickly derail your budget. Do you even have a budget? If you don't, you need one. You need to tell your money where it needs to go because if you don't, your money will find a way out of your pockets and it never finds its way into a good place. Nobody accidentally invests or saves. If you do have a budget, how did you come up with those numbers? If you just guessed, you're probably gonna need to adjust and that's fine. A budget is a guide and your budget will be ever changing and ever evolving as you become better with money, as you become more focused with your spending. You also won't get to financial independence by chance. You need to purposely reduce your spending. You need to purposely invest wisely and you need to purposely look for ways to increase your income. It can be hard to do, especially if you're not surrounded by like-minded people. Listening to stories of people who are on the same path to financial independence, who are at different points of their journey, can be really helpful in inspiring you and keeping you going when you have a mistake or an unexpected expense or a great big, oh, I forgot to put that in my budget. That's okay. That happens to all of us. Constantly being reminded of why you're doing this and that there are other people on the path too can be hugely helpful. Do what no one else is doing now so that you can do what no one else is doing later. Every Monday on the Bigger Pockets Money podcast, we talk to people who are on the path to financial independence, everyday people who are just like you, who are sharing their story of what worked and probably more important, what mistakes they made and lessons they learned from it. You don't need to go to the school of hard knocks. You can learn from what other people have done and improve your financial situation just by hearing what others in the same situation are doing with their finances. You can learn something new on every episode, but you're also gonna hear a lot of the same. Spend less, earn more, invest wisely. Why? Because that's the proven way to build wealth and get to financial independence. Have you done something unique that had an impact on your finances? Leave us a comment below and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more information on building wealth and becoming financially independent. For Bigger Pockets Money, this is Mindy Jensen signing off.